<laughs> that puppet was digging in my head. Hi, it's Friday. Uh, it's Q&A time. Hope everybody had a better week than me. Uh, and I hope you are ready for the weekend. And all the magic I am sure it will bring. Are you sleeping, puppet? <laughs> all right. So I'm getting weather alerts because it's going to be rainy and windy. A tornado. It's not going to be a tornado. Calm down, everybody. Grandpa Kevin said, what do you think the life... The movie Life will be worth seeing. Uh, it could. It looks kind of like a realistic Aliens movie. Uh, it's got Deadpool in it and La La Land guy in it. I Ryan think. Gosling. I don't know. Ryan Reynolds and some other guy. I don't know if it's Jake Jungall, don't Joan Hall, or Ryan Grossling. I don't know. Uh, they're astronauts. They find a thing. They poke a thing, and it uh, is an alien that tries to kill everybody. Could be good, or it could suck. I don't know. I haven't heard. There's zero buzz about it, unlike my hair, which everybody is tweeting about. Um, but no, I don't know if it'll be good or not. There's no buzz, so that can't be good. Heather said, "Have you figured out why your socks hate you yet?" Uh, I think it's my shoes. I've narrowed it down to a shoe issue. When I lace my shoes up, when I walk, it's a lot of heel walk, I guess, because the heel of my shoes pointing down my sock. It's spectacularly inconvenient. Uh, I have like four pairs of socks that are comfortable and, and you know uh, available to wear. It's a struggle. Um, hashtag struggle is real. Struggle is real. John said, "What movie traumatized you as a kid?" The Birds. Oh gosh. Oh, The Birds. Good lord. Uh, when I was about six or so, my father had me watch The Birds. He really didn't warn me at all about the premise of the movie. He just uh, was like, what are, you, what are you so upset for? It's a movie. Look how fake it is. What are you, why is it upset you that the birds are eating people's eyeballs? Uh, so, yeah, the birds. Uh, to this day, I don't like birds. Uh, and I don't, uh, I don't like to be near large numbers of them. So, thanks, Dad. <laughs> Billy said, as I sit here chowing down chicken wings, what's your favorite flavor wing? Honey barbecue. Honey barbecue is my favorite wing. Do you have a favorite wing? Mm. Your Batman, your favorite wing is Nightwing. Oh, hashtag comic book reference. Pew, pew, pew. Hashtags aren't cool. Whatever. So Do you have a favorite wing? Mm, wings are good. But wings no. are good. I don't like spicy ones. Not spicy. Um... Billy said, why won't you watch The Blacklist anymore? It's so good again. Uh, I don't know. I'm just not... Listen, it's really hard for me to maintain interest in almost everything. Uh, I'm sure that's a symptom of something. Snobbery, if you ask my wife. Um, I don't know. I may... I don't know. I'm not going to make any promises. I may look at it. I don't know. Xander said, how do you deal with mean people? So this is a really tough question. Because uh, I was a bullied kid. Um, I got picked out a lot. I never really stuck up for myself. So uh, I understand what you're going through, buddy. Um, you know, you got to stand up for yourself. Um, but you should never... I, I'm not a big person that would like be in a fight. Uh, I think that if kids are, are picking on you, you need to make sure that you let your mom and your dad know. Uh, and let a teacher know, uh, or somebody like you know, uh, one adult know that you're that this kid, these kids are picking on you, and messing with your stuff. Um, nobody's allowed to put their hands on you, uh, so you you know if somebody's messing with you, you tell them no. You walk away and you get an adult. You tell your mom and dad. Your mom and dad love you very much. They got your back. You know, so. You know, I know it's really hard to walk away from bullies. I, I, I know firsthand. Uh, but, you know, you really, I just tell, you know, like, stick up for yourself. But you need to make sure you let adults know if you're getting picked on. Do you got anything you want to contribute? I just try to ignore them. Like, they are important. Yeah, they're, they're not. They're just trying to make you feel bad. They aren't important. And a lot of times, they're trying to make you feel bad because they, they feel bad. Like, you have a mom and dad who love you very much. I wouldn't do anything for you. And not all those kids are, are as fortunate as you are. Mm -hmm. 
So you got toys and an Xbox One. Some kids don't have that. So when they don't have stuff and they're jealous uh, and they're dumb, uh, they're mean. Uh, and they take it out on other people, which isn't fair, um, but that's life, buddy. Um, so you just got to try to ignore them the best you can, and if they're picking on you, tell them the dull. All right? Okay. And one day, they'll look back, and they'll be like, look at Xander. Now I wish I could be friends with Xander. Mm -hmm. and, they'll be like, and then you could just be like, nope, you're a mean little... Nah. Use the... Nah. That's my favorite. But yeah, you know what? There are people to this day, Xander, that picked on me that I don't talk to, because I, you know, they weren't, you know, I don't want to, I want to be around nice people. So I've chosen to be around nice people. So that you should do that too. And if they're picking on you, you should tell an adult. Yes, dude. Dude. Catherine said, "What's your favorite springtime activity?" Taking naps. Swimming. Taking naps. I'm a big nap. I'm pro nap. Captain said, hashtag ask AJ if your clothes could be all one color, what color would you choose? Black. Because I look good in black. Me too. More than any other color. Me and too. then black goes with everything, like every color. <laughs> like even if you wore some some other color, it would go with it. And like if you wear black with black, it goes with yes. the other. So black is just like always a good color. Black and green goes Most together. Black and white goes together. Black and red goes together. Black and gold goes together. Black okay, and stop. Like black and yellow, of, black stop. Stop. Black. Most of my clothes are black because of that. Okay. So, Catherine said, "Are we ever gonna have a walking dead ch walking dead chat again?" <laughs> oh, yeah. I don't it's know what's pretty happening. good this season. You know, I do miss the Walking Dead chats. Uh, I'm kicking it around. It's really a struggle for me. Uh, I don't know about the show. We don't always have time for that. Uh, yeah, and I can't promise anything. I'll, I will review it, Catherine. For you, I will review it. But if I do the chats again, everybody has to be nice. No poo-pooing at everybody's favorite character. No constant chronic complaining, even for me. Hold me accountable. Uh, it's got to be a happy, friendly, fun environment, or I'm not going to do it. All right. All right. Moving on. Jake said, what is your favorite childhood memory? This was a tough question for me, too. Uh, you know, I can't complain about my childhood, really. Uh, looking back, uh, people had it much worse than I did. Um, I think one of my favorite uh, childhood memories is riding bikes uh, down Orange Road uh, to Speedway and uh, to Brock and Jeff's house who were childhood uh, chums of mine. The poop with throwers! The Brock threw a horse <laughs> turd and it hit me above the eye one time. <laughs> Thanks, Alan. Oh, okay. So, yeah, that happened. So, anyway, so that's probably it. Uh, I don't know. Is there anything else? No. All right. The embarrassing childhood memories of time. <laughs> so, uh, uh, it's the weekend. Uh, the weather might be kind of sour uh, in this neck of the woods, so we'll see. Uh, I'm going to put some overtime in. going to go to the gym, et cetera, et cetera. My shoulder does feel better. I know that everybody who's concerned, it's also trending on Twitter. But uh, really, I'm, no, I'm, I'm doing okay. Do you have anything you would like to add before uh, we wrap it up here? My tooth hurts. Allie has braces again, uh, and her tooth hurts, but well, her final birthday present came in. It's Alexa! She, she didn't get uh, Alexa. She got uh, a little mini Alexa. Same thing. It's an Alexa hookup thing. I don't know. I don't know. Small version. Small version. Yep. So, uh, be good. Uh, the world the world seems scarier than it is. Uh, love and respect each other. Peace and love. Peace and love. And as they say in France, do unto others as they'd have do unto you.